Okay? So you can be efficient on the highway, and you can, you can also go off-roading. Um, it's going to have uh, the highest clearance of any, any production truck. The motor is the heart of an electric vehicle. Even automobiles that are manufactured specifically for intense off-roading use can sustain damage after a day-long excursion. Enter the Cybertruck. The electric pickup with many breakthrough innovations that will revolutionize the truck market. It's equipped with the most advanced Tesla motor that can tackle all kinds of rough terrain to become the fastest and most powerful pickup with 98% efficiency. So what exactly does that mean? What is the special engine, and how powerful does this engine perform on the Cybertruck exactly? Let's find out in today's episode of Tesla Car World. Welcome back to our channel. Before we begin, please show your support by subscribing if you haven't already, and ringing the bell so you won't miss out on any of our interesting videos in the future. Now, let's get started with today's content. It's important to understand how the motors in the previous models work. An induction electric motor is the invention of the genius scientist Nikola Tesla. With electromagnetic induction as the basic principle of operation, these motors generate AC power, or alternating current, with the help of rotating magnetic fields. Just like any other motor, this one is also made up of a rotor and a stator. These motors are self-starting because the rotating magnetic fields enable them. This benefit is based on Faraday's law and the law of lenses. One could even understand how a typical induction motor works. The stator's rotating magnetic field sparks an EMF in the rotor, which is then carried by the conductor barbs. The cause of the current generation is the speed difference between the rotating magnetic flux and the rotor conductor. The efficiency of induction motors is also pretty low. When the power input decreases, the power factor always lags, and the efficiency goes down by an astonishing amount. The torque is especially poor during the starting of the motor. It also tends to draw high amounts of current, causing a dip in voltage all around and reducing the functioning capacity of the vehicle. It was noted by the engineers that the efficiency dwindled by around 3-5%, to which is a rather large figure. This is why Tesla's future products, such as the Cybertruck, have opted to go for IPM-SYNRM motors. The performance of the Cybertruck motor is very strong at, like I said before, 98%, compared to 96% at normal motor speeds. Let's uh, actually have a tug of war here with an F-150. See, see which one can pull which. The motor has a great impact on the towing capacity. The Ford F-150 has been one of the most capable trucks on the market since day one of its inception. The 3.3 liter V6 is the base engine in the F-150 lineup. It can produce 290 horsepower and 265 pounds per feet of torque. The F-150 can also tow between 7,700 to 13,200 pounds. For comparison, the Cybertruck has about 690 horsepower and 824 pounds per feet of torque, which is four times as much as the F-150. And with three electric motors, Cybertruck was rated at a whopping towing capacity of 14,000 pounds. That's 800 pounds more than the best available F-150 model. Thus, the Cybertruck will arrive with best-in-class towing in 2022, unless Ford does something about that after. Moreover, the F-150 Limited is the quickest version of the current gen truck. It hits 60 miles per hour from a standing start in 5.1 seconds, which is mighty impressive for a truck. In contrast, the range-topping tri-motor all-wheel drive Cybertruck is even quicker with a 0 to 60 mile per hour benchmark of only 2.9 seconds. That means the fastest Cybertruck model is 2.2 seconds quicker than the fastest Ford F-150. And to make yet another comparison, you'll see that the price of the Tesla Model Y in 2022 is between $59,990 to $69,990. This vehicle uses an IPM SYNRM motor with a 378 kilowatt output and 493 newton meters of total torque. For the same price, the Cybertruck may use an upgraded IPM SYNRM motor with a 600 kilowatt capacity and 1400 newton meters of total torque, 
a four times increase in torque. But how does one explain this motor achieving such a powerful level on the Cybertruck? The IPM Sin RM motor is an incredible demonstration of the engineering that goes some way to output maximum efficiency as the world prepares to shift from petrol vehicles to electric ones. This pickup truck combines the permanent magnet motor and the synchronous reluctance motor by inserting permanent magnets into the air slots in the Sin RM. The permanent magnets that are aligned with the RMF to reduce the field form the permanent magnet, so at high velocities, back EMF is minimized, and the majority of the torque comes from reluctance. The permanent magnets are also segmented to reduce eddy currents, and therefore reduce energy losses. And yeah, 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 it sounds interesting, but how can it do such powerful things? The main reason why we call the IPM Sin RM motor the superstar motor of the EV world is because of its torque speed characteristic. Let's consider these two electric cars. One car is fitted with an IPM Sin RM, and the other is fitted with an induction motor of the same torque output. As you can see, the IPM Sin RM motor has a wider range of higher torque values than the induction motor, implying that the motor must produce a high torque in IPM. The car will get high torque even at high speeds. However, in the car with the induction motor, the motor speed has to be reduced to achieve the same torque. Now, you might be wondering why the IPM Sin RM motor has a wider torque band than the induction motors. This is because in the IPM Sin RM motor, the forces come from two different phenomena. One due to interaction between the permanent magnets, and the second is due to the reluctance action at high motor speed. They increase the reluctance torque contribution by adjusting the RMF angle. This way, the torque remains constant for a wider speed range. Due to these advantages of the IPM Sin RM motor, even the induction motors in the other high-performance EVs are being replaced by them. The Tesla Model S Plaid, which is the fastest accelerating production car in the world, uses only the IPM Sin RM motor. New technology enables maximum durability while reducing the need for continual maintenance with higher efficiency and stability for the Cybertruck. The average life expectancy of an electric car motor is 17 years. The process of generating heat in the engine reduces efficiency and life. Because of this, the IPM Sin RM rotors require a high level of cooling. How do you feel about the Cybertruck's motor? Let me know your thoughts in the comments section down below. Otherwise, that's it for today's episode, and we sincerely thank you for watching and for all of your support of our channel. As always, if you enjoyed our video, please leave us a like, share the video, subscribe to the channel, and ring that bell to stay up to date on exciting developments in the world of EVs and green technology. Once again, we thank you so much, and we hope to see you again next time. Until then, take care and be safe.